Okay, what's going on guys? A brand new YouTube video and as always couldn't hold back going on to get that uh that next shard video out, you feel me while the shard thing is active. I might as well try to farm this. So I've done like three two or three videos on this one event already. And then two what it is is I'm trying to keep my number one spot. I see somebody's kind of creeping up on me here in the champion chase tournament. I see this person trying to creep up and take that uh, number one from me. But uh, you know what I'm saying? I got to make sure I stay above that. So we're looking to get two legendaries out of these 50 stone. Let's get it. Let's go. Three, two, one. Boom. First 10. Let's see what's happening here. A Drake. We got Drake. Oh, uh, that's all, all garbage. Except for Drake. Let's see what's going on with Drake. Grants an extra turn if the target is killed. Attacks on enemy. Uh, if the target has less than 50% HP, this attack is always critical. Uh, and then he places decreased speed and decreased accuracy on all buffs on all enemies for two turns if this attack is critical. So basically, he does not need accuracy at all. And he's going to be like freaking nuking things. Okay, I think he's actually a pretty good champion. A lot of people use him. So we got another corporate. Uh, Caliber, Elhane, Bogwalker, looks like freaking Godzilla. Oh, wow. Okay. Next tail, let's go. Let's see what's going on here. Another Caliber. Yumitokia, I think I already have her. I already have Adriel as well. Goodness, I'm getting like the same characters almost. When attacked by a boss, decreases incoming damage by 50% instead before counter attacking. And then that Adriel is just Adriel. I like that I'm starting to see some more um, reflect damage champions though. All right, next four, the next ten. We got a, a, a epic off the rip, two epics. So. Kind of seeing some um, some of the same ones show up. Delver, I've got her three times in the past like day or something. Ripper, okay, let's see what he's got going on. He's a damage champion. Hold on. All right, we resume back to our regularly scheduled services, um, or programs. Uh, oh wow, so he's a HP destroying champion. He's like a, a unit, okay. So uh, I think that's, oh, why did they tell me I couldn't open anymore? Am I out of, uh, must be out of space, yep. Um, and I don't want to have any space there either. It sucks. Give me one second here. Figure this junk out. Hold on, I'm gonna clear it. Hold on. So we resume to our uh, regularly scheduled services. I keep saying services. We resume to our regularly scheduled uh, programs. Y'all, man, you know what I'm saying? It looks like uh, all of a sudden we just we just gained more stones. Like, uh, like, like it just it just popped up. So, uh, yeah, uh, <laughs> gotta open it up. <laughs> oh, we got a stag knight. Let's go. I had him before, but I got rid of him because I didn't know what I was doing. Oh, Huskerall. Wait a minute. Is he good? Oh, I got him yesterday. He's garbage. I jumped off my screen, dog. This dude looks bad, too. Yep. Stag knight to keep your team alive, basically. That boy, that boy be going crazy. Actually, I don't know what I'm talking about. All right, let's go to the next one. Come on, we looking for a legendary man. Royal Guard? Is he a legendary? Like, is he like a legendary? Oh, wow. The return cooldown, too.
Oh wow, he's a good champion. Okay. Hot to carry again. Taurus, Hotatsu. I've never seen Taurus before. Wait a minute. Wait, he places poison on all enemies. This champion receives damage equal to 99% of their HP. Places an unkillable on the champion for two turns. Has an 80% chance of placing. Wait. So he just places poison on everybody and then he's just kind of... Okay. He places four poison. Oh, Tatsu, you guys already seen him. Uh, increased defense and continuous heal. Alright, on to the next. We're looking for a legendary main. Like, where's the legends at? We got another Venom Mage and another Ripper. You guys already seen Venom Age, you already know what's going on. You seen Ripper earlier, so I think you got like forty more stones or something. Tarshan. Dang, my luck is just really bad right now. Come on, legendaries. Like, what is this? What is this? I got one stone. Dude, like, bro, like, bro, what just happened to me, bro? What just happened to me, bro? This can't be real. This cannot be real, bro. That's three bad shard videos in a row, bro. Like, oh no. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> I appreciate y'all for watching, man. Y'all see my luck is down bad now, so we might have to chill. I'm have to chill on shard opens. Goodness, bro. I ain't know this thing go down like that. Now one legendary and barely any epics. You know this dude finna catch up to me. I'm done though. I'm done. Like I'm not. No more coins. I got double his points, but this dude, all he gotta do. Is... Oh well, I guess it doesn't really help. If he pulls like ten legendaries, he still won't be. He still won't be next to me. He'll be like um. Like 12 kids, he pulls 10 legendaries, so I think I'm number one. Like for a long shot. Uh, this Niles guy just popped up out of nowhere, though. He wasn't on the board. A lot of these people weren't on the board, and they just kind of popped up. So, shoot. Hopefully, I keep it. I feel like uh, pulling during during these events is kind of why the, the my luck is so bad. Cause it's like there's so many people that are pulling right now, so I'm pulling during a, a freaking summoning event. So I guess that's probably what it is. That could be what it is. So I've got um, well, I have 55 uh, shards, plus uh whatever I get from Fire Knight. It's an extra five there. And five there, but I'm not gonna get that. I mean, I could farm, but shoot. I'm pretty sure I already got this one yet. I could take number one from them. I 
That's like a whole day. Anyways, thank y'all for watching, man. Appreciate y'all. Y'all take care, man. Good night.